Jacqueline Smith is a famous American actress and businesswoman who is best known for her role as Kelly Garrett in the television series Charlie's Angels that aired from 1976 to 1981. She was one of the most beautiful and successful women in Hollywood. But to get there, Jacqueline Smith had to face many challenges and tragedies that threatened to break her spirit. Join us as we explore the story of Jacqueline Smith, the angel who fell from grace but never gave up on her dreams. Jacqueline Smith's life was a bittersweet tale of dreams and disappointments. Born as Jacqueline Ellen Smith on October 26, 1945 in Houston, Texas, she grew up in a seemingly happy home. Little did she know that life's trials were waiting just around the corner. Her father, Jack Smith, with Russian Jewish roots, and her mother, Margaret Ellen, from diverse English, Scottish, Irish, and Welsh heritage, provided her with a loving foundation. But as Jacqueline navigated through life, she struggled to find her true purpose. Grappling with a love-hate relationship with her career choices, at first, she thought psychology and drama were her calling, so she enrolled at Trinity University. But fate intervened, and she impulsively dropped out, seeking her destiny in the bustling streets of New York City. There, she joined the Balanchine School of American Ballet, hoping that dance would be her savior. But once again, her dreams shifted and she found herself drawn to modeling and acting. Although she managed to secure some opportunities in TV commercials and print ads, her journey in the film industry remained challenging. She took unpaid roles in movies like Goodbye Columbus in 1969 and faced constant struggles to establish herself. But in the midst of her career hurdles, Jacqueline's heart found a comforting refuge in the arms of Roger Davis. A fellow actor and love blossomed between them. They took a leap of faith, exchanging vows in 1968, seeking happiness and fulfillment in the embrace of each other's love. Then in 1970, she got a chance to play the role of a journalist in the film The Adventurers, offering a glimpse of hope. But as her career started to take off, her personal life spiraled into despair. Her marriage with Roger reached its breaking point, and in 1975, they decided to part ways, leaving behind shattered dreams and unfulfilled promises. But amidst these tumultuous times, Jacqueline refused to succumb to sorrow. She pressed on, persevering through heartache and disappointment. Finally, in 1976, she received a seemingly life-changing opportunity to star in the pilot of a new TV series, Charlie's Angels. The show was a success, catapulting her into stardom and making her an iconic figure. And in the midst of crime solving and action on the set of Charlie's Angels, Jacqueline Smith unexpectedly found a love story of her own in the very same year. It was a perfect plot twist in her life's narrative, and Dennis Cole was the fortunate man. They exchanged vows in 1978, and for a while, it seemed like they had everything they ever wanted. But as fate would have it, love had its own plans. The happiness they shared was fleeting, and in 1981, their marriage tragically came to an end. Behind the scenes of her public life, Jacqueline faced private struggles. Grappling with the complexities of her marriage, she revealed that Dennis battled with drug and alcohol issues. And the ultimate betrayal came when he cheated on her with a younger woman. It was an emotional storm that tested her strength and resilience. Yet, in the face of heartbreak and disappointment, she refused to be defined by the bitter chapters of her life, finding the strength to continue excelling in her career and personal endeavors. She later met Tony Richmond, and this relationship seemed like her chance to prove that third time's the charm. With hope in her heart, she believed that this time, happiness would be within her grasp. Their love blossomed rapidly, and just a year later, they exchanged vows. This time, things felt different, and the marriage endured longer, blessed with the arrival of two lovely children, Gaston and Spencer. But cracks began to form, and the weight of infidelity and financial struggles 
became too heavy to bear. Sadly, the marriage fell apart too. And for her to avoid a messy legal battle in 1989, she had to pay a huge sum of $4 million for sole custody of the children. But did Jacqueline give up on love? No. At age 51, she remained open to the possibility of finding love again and she eventually found love with Brad, the surgeon who had touched her father's heart and hers. Their love blossomed in secret, and when they finally revealed their relationship in 1993, it felt like a long hidden treasure had been unveiled. Four years later, they exchanged vows in a dreamy candlelight ceremony, promising to stand by each other's side through thick and thin. This time, her love story was different, because they are still living happily together till this very day. A living testament that fairy tales can indeed come true. But just when everything seemed to be falling into place, life threw a heartbreaking curveball her way. After saying I do and celebrating her marriage, Jacqueline had to face the heart-wrenching loss of her dear father in 1998. They were super close, and he taught her some incredible life lessons like being kind, generous, and humble. Dealing with her grief, proved to be a heavy burden, but she leaned on her faith, family, and friends to get through it. And to honor the memories of her father, she kept working hard and stayed true to her passions. Sadly, Jacqueline Smith's life took quite a turn in 2003 again. A routine medical checkup turned into a nightmare when she received the devastating news of breast cancer. The news was tough to bear, but fortunately, they caught it early and her tumor was small. Jacqueline underwent a lumpectomy and radiation therapy with admirable courage. And since then, she has been cancer free. Her journey through this challenging time showcased her incredible strength. But Jacqueline didn't just let this experience slide. She wanted to make a difference. So she became an advocate for the early detection and prevention of breast cancer. Using her platform to raise awareness and support others, the whole ordeal made her value life even more and cherish her family and friends. And despite all the hardships she faced, she never let go of her dreams. She kept shining on TV and in movies and even created her own clothing, perfume, skincare, and wig brands. Jacqueline Smith is a true inspiration, showing us all that we can conquer anything in life throws our way and still follow our passions. Even at 76 years old, Jacqueline Smith is still going strong, but she's also facing some real challenges in the entertainment world. She's been open about using cosmetic procedures like Botox and fillers to maintain a natural appearance, fight her insecurities about aging, and to stay relevant in the entertainment business. She still experiences frustration by the lack of opportunities and respect for mature actresses. But you know what? Jacqueline is a fighter, and she's not ready to throw in the towel just yet. She's got so much more to offer. And even with life's ups and downs, she's not letting anything hold her back. And that's pretty inspiring. So cheers to Jacqueline, a woman who keeps pushing forward no matter what. If you enjoyed this video, there's a good chance you'll enjoy the one showing on your screen right now. Click enjoy and don't forget to subscribe to the channel. See you on the next one.